What's going on guys, Flynn1 back to another video and today I wanted to talk about some games and features I'd like to see come to the Switch. Okay, so lately Nintendo has been under a lot of fire with their online service and just a lot of stuff. I feel like Nintendo has kind of been hitting and missing a lot of what their core audience is asking for. And, you know, I think if we are more vocal about what we would like to see, that maybe Nintendo might catch on to it. So today I wanted to talk about some games and features that I would like to see come to the Nintendo Switch via just physical games, digital games, and some online features that I'd like to see. Okay, so first let's start off with the most controversial topic, and that is the Nintendo Switch online service. Um, Nintendo kind of hit missed the mark by releasing it a year late, but I don't think that it's a horrible feature. I understand why they're trying to get in on this service, considering Xbox has had it for a long time, uh, PlayStation's had it for a long time, and I can understand why the Switch would start, why Nintendo would want to start using this service. But Nintendo is lacking in terms of what it offers with the service. With Xbox and PlayStation, you get free games and game discounts, whereas Switch has promised us game discounts, or Nintendo has has promised us game, game discounts but we haven't seen anything quite like that yet but we are getting the NES services which are pretty much digital uh, versions of NES games that we can play online with friends which is a really cool option and given that we are paying a way cheaper price for a year via a $12 price point is not too horrible considering the competitor prices but what we get for that money I don't feel like we're getting our money's worth. Yes, we're getting access to a lot of really cool NES titles. We're getting to play online. But for the past year and a half almost, we have gotten to play online for free in terms of being able to play with friends and socialize and do everything like that. Um, what I would really like to see out of the Nintendo Switch Online is I would like to see some of the discounts, maybe a free game or two. Um, kind of like how how the competitors have uh, free monthly games and that you get to access for purchasing their online service. Um, or at least maybe some exclusive demos for first party titles would be fantastic. But because of all the third party support that Nintendo is getting recently with their huge flood of digital games that's on the Switch now. Um, I feel like they could probably work something out to give us a little something um, in terms of of, of some, something with the online Switch service uh, instead of just a few Nintendo Switch Online NES games. Um, I would love to maybe see access to an online virtual console, if you will. Maybe not just NES titles, maybe different titles from different generations like the uh, Super Nintendo, the N64, the GameCube, uh, potentially even the Wii. And I think if they actually integrated that, maybe up their price point a little bit, and gave us access to the libraries from all of their systems, that would be phenomenal. That would be insane. Having Instead of having a virtual console where you, you buy and download the games like the Wii or Wii U, you could actually have a monthly service plan like the Nintendo Switch Online to access a virtual console of a variety of library game or of a wide library uh, selection of of titles from their previous consoles and I think that would be fantastic it would save a lot of money it would introduce a lot of new gamers to a whole era of games that they have never gotten to check out especially ones that are super rare and high priced right now getting to play Smash Bros and Smash Bros Melee on the Switch would be fantastic getting to play like uh, Luigi's Mansion or getting to play Super Mario RPG or uh, just any of those games on the Switch would be phenomenal. And they could tie that into the Nintendo Online Switch service. Uh, or Nintendo Switch Online service. And it would be phenomenal. It would be incredible. And it would give them a step above their competitors for sure. And they can leave it to exclusive titles only as well, depending on what um, what the heads at Nintendo decide to do. But could we see that happening instead of a virtual console getting that? Let me know what you think down in the comments below. I think that would be fantastic. Now, continuing with the online aspect of the Nintendo Switch, there are a few apps that I would love to see come to the Nintendo Switch. We just recently got YouTube, but um, I would like to see them integrate more chat features. I would love to see maybe a standalone 
uh, chat in terms of being able to talk just in-game like you can everywhere else. That would be fantastic considering the Switch is capable of it. Or seeing an app like Discord on the Switch. Right now, um, there isn't too much going on with other like other consoles and a Discord integration. Most people are having to connect through Discord and kind of doing what you're doing with your phone and your Switch right now. But I haven't seen a console really integrate Discord into their systems yet. And I think Nintendo could get a one-up as well, uh, pun intended, um, in terms of jumping ahead of their competition by putting Discord. There are a lot of Nintendo communities and friends and everything that pl talk on Discord. And I think a Discord integration app would be fantastic to where you can play your online Switch games and talk to your friends via a way more broad spectrum than a phone app. Um, but that's definitely a feature I would love to see. Another app I would really like to see, I would love to see some kind of like editing editing app or something in terms of of like what uh, competitors have in terms of video editing and doing uh, stuff like that. I know that the capture software in the Switch already has something kind of implemented for a very basic term, but maybe something more like the um, something more intricate where you can do intros and outros and maybe voiceover or something like that. I think that would be really cool and a really big benefit to the Nintendo Switch being able to do commentary for different content creators. I think that would be a really cool valuable option for different content creators that are recording and doing stuff on the go. I think that would be fantastic to implement onto the system itself. And I would really love to see an app that would kind of integrate that into the into the system for for us content creators. Now, in terms of games, um there are a lot of games that we all want to see on the Switch. I mean, they're releasing a lot of games, but we're still not gonna getting a lot of we're still not getting a lot of first party titles that we want to see. And I do understand that they do take time. I know that they are released. They just started hiring on people for a new Legend of Zelda game, um, which is the Switch's very first uh, exclusive console exclusive Zelda game. Um, whereas Breath of the Wild came out on the on the Wii U and then the Switch. Um, being a launch title for the Switch. Um, I'm hoping to see some more first-party titles. Uh, maybe a new Mario Kart would be fantastic to maybe launch alongside with the Mario Kart Mobile that's being rumored around. A, uh, I know a new Metroid is coming. Um, I would love to see something new in the Donkey Kong series. I would love to maybe see a new Star Fox game. Uh, that would be fantastic. Um, I know they just released Starlink, uh, but I would love to see an ex like a Star Fox exclusive game. Um, would be incredible and like there's so many IPs that Nintendo has left behind that I would love to see revamped like I would love to see um, I would love to see just some old NES games come back now I know a lot of people have been complaining about HD remasters you know why bother remastering all these games when you can make a second game and stuff like that which don't get me wrong I'll be getting into se sequels here in a second but HD remasters that I would like to see would definitely be, um, would definitely have to be like a Super Mario RPG remastered, Super Mario Sunshine remastered, um, maybe Super Mario Galaxy and Galaxy 2. Uh, I would love to see like a Mario Party, uh, revamp just all of the best like mini games from all the Mario Party games. I would love to see some of the other Mario games, like, uh, some of the Mario RPG style games come come to the Switch like uh, Paper Mario, I would love to see. HD remasters are not a bad thing. Um, I'm just wondering. There's just so many of them out there. It wouldn't be that hard to just kind of port them over. But new HD remasters that we haven't seen before would be fantastic. I mean, there's no reason that we would need to buy Legend of Zelda Wind Waker six times, considering it's already been remastered three times, if I remember right. Uh, or re-released three times. Um... But you get to just the idea. Now, in terms of sequels, I would love to see Super Mario RPG 2, Super Mario Sunshine 2. Uh, two fantastic games that I would love to see a sequel for. Um, and in terms, they kind of said they have done that. Paper Mario was said to be Super Mario RPG 2, but it wasn't the same style. And now that Nintendo and Square Enix are becoming more buddy-buddy again, I would love to see what they could do with this 
and I would love to see that uh, as well as Super Mario Sunshine 2. It is uh, an area in the Super Mario universe that we haven't gotten to revisit. Galaxy 2 got a got a or Galaxy 2 uh, came out or Galaxy got a sequel with Galaxy 2. Uh, the Mushroom Kingdom has been has been explored time in and time out. Um, and it was also revisited in Odyssey and just so much done with all the other franchises or all the other worlds in Mario. But we haven't seen much else outside of Mario Kart and Smash Bros. for uh, for Super Mario Sunshine. And I would love to see that as well. And actually some levels in Super Mario RPG and Smash would be fantastic. Anyways, um... In terms of in terms of what else to see to come to the Switch, anything that Nintendo is going to release first party is never going to be bad. Overall, every first party title, uh, Mario game, Zelda game, Donkey Kong game, has has been fantastic. Um, I don't think they've ever released a bad game in terms of those franchises, and I would just love to see some more first party titles come to the Switch. Um, but that's just that's just the general gist of it, guys. I mean, um, let me know what you guys think. Let me know down in the comments below. Um, what do you want to see come to the Switch? What features, uh, physical or digital, uh, come to the Switch? What would you like to see more of out of the online service that Switch, the Nintendo Switch offers? And what games would you like to see ported over or made for the Nintendo Switch? Let me know in the comments below. Also, hit me up on my social media links that are linked down in the description. You can let me know there. We can talk about it. And maybe we can brainstorm something up to make a petition. Who knows? But there's already one started for Kingdom Hearts, the Kingdom Hearts series. So, who knows what could happen. But uh, thank you guys so much for watching the video. If you did like the video, give me a thumbs up. If you didn't, give me a thumbs down. Let me know why you didn't like it and how can I how I can improve in the comments down below. And if you guys are new to the channel and you want to see more of my content, hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell icon to get notified whenever I post a video. I try to post at least once a week, if not twice. Um, but it all depends on kind of how work goes and everything like that. But um, I do appreciate you all for watching and making it through this far. And just thank you for all the support you guys show to me. But uh, that's all the time I got for today, guys. Hope you guys enjoy the rest of the content coming up soon. And I will see you in the next one. Peace. Fire. Flame. Water. Heart. I am Captain Planet.